This weekend, we're building a mobile mini cottage. I'm Andrew. I'm Kevin. Welcome, Welcome to Brojax. <laughs> For the mobile mini cottage, we're going to build up from the old trailer. Inside, we'll need two sleeping platforms. One will hide dry storage for our clothes and camping gear, as well as house a large pull-out drawer which will store our food and kitchen stuff. The top of the second sleeping platform will convert to a countertop for our pull-out kitchen. The walls will be sheathed in pine cladding, with corrugated metal covering the lower part, as well as our angled roof. A porthole window on one side and a sliding door in the back will give us fresh air on a hot summer night. Once we set up camp, we're going to want our beer cart, which will attach to a hitch on the back of the cottage. And one whole wall will flip up to provide a huge awning to relax under. A few finishing touches, like a portable lamp post and fire pit, make this our most ambitious build yet. So if we want to get this done before Dad arrives, we better get moving. The other day we bought uh, essentially like a giant drawer that people uh, put underneath their decks to hold all their toys and gear and stuff. We just got that drawer put in. That took quite a long time to build, get the tracks right, so that was good. We're about uh, midday here. We've got quite a bit done. Whoa. Yeah, we were kind of thinking that the uh, snowstorm the other day would keep that at home. Apparently that's not the case. The roads are fine now. They're on their way. This looks good. Yeah, it's starting to get there. I'm going to try to make a little frame up the top that'll pop out. We occupy this cottage quite a bit, and when we're down here, we're a pretty big impact on this space. So I think uh, Dad's probably on his way right now, man. We're in trouble. We set out to build the ultimate mobile mini cottage, and I think we succeeded. This is a cool spot. I don't think I ever would have come here if we didn't have this thing. There's quite a few good little features on this one. The beer cart went on really well. Definitely my favorite part, though, is the awning door. The way it opens the whole thing up, you get a lot of air through it. Uh, if it's raining, you can sit outside, but the undercover. You know, there were a lot of features on this thing. We've got the giant pull-out drawer that turns into a countertop. We've got a lamp post and a light inside, the sliding back door that Kevin built. We have a campfire that converts into a tabletop. It's the turntable. Oh, you know what we forgot? Uh, Music. We got a guitar. This is a good one, man. <laughs> Cheers. How are those shrimp coming? Uh, we're getting there. We have enough maple syrup now that we can uh, throw it on some pancakes. Boiling liquid on my hands. So next step is to switch this off. We're gonna put in the grills, turn it to a breakfast bar, and get cooking. 